Chairman, thank you. Thanks again for all the work and uh, all the organization for the staff that worked on this exceptionally hard uh, through the process. Uh, this was the place that I thought we would hammer through some very difficult ideas and then go sell them to the rest of the body. Uh, because the other members of the House and the Senate are not processing through what we're processing through. Uh, we were the ones tasked to do the research, to do the hard work, to think through the ideas, to look at the history, come up with a set of good bipartisan ideas, and then to be able to present it to the House and the Senate and go win them over and say this is a better solution. This is how we avoid debt ceiling fights and CRs and shutdowns, and this is how we solve all that mess. Uh, this is how we actually spend time looking at debt and deficit uh, rather than every 10 years stopping to look at it, get a regular process. This is how we get a bipartisan process. We all said that at the very beginning. Uh, we want a bipartisan process, and we all said at the beginning, the Senate's the problem. Uh, and it's interesting to me today that we started with, we can't get into a real conversation in the Senate right now. Uh, this was an opportunity to be able to say, let's set a set of proposals on voteramas and on process and things that actually get it through the Senate process and get us to a bipartisan work. We weren't able to do that, and uh, that's disappointing to me. And I hope that we can continue this dialogue and we can bring a set of ideas uh, to both of our bodies in the days ahead. But as Joni mentioned, our, our mandate began with significant reform. And my fear is, is that if we come out and have a vote, and even if it passes the House and the Senate, <clears throat> and everyone walks away and says, we now do budgeting every two years, we did our significant reform, we all know in this room nothing really changed. And we'll have the exact same issues next year again. And then everyone will say, I thought you significantly reformed the budget process, and now nothing works still. So I, I, I can't support this today. I would love to. But there are so many unfinished ideas that really are significant reform, that I would hope that we would not spoil the opportunity to do those things by doing much, much, much less uh, in the days ahead. So let's keep the conversation going. Uh, and I don't know what that structure will be to be able to do that, but this group knows more than most uh, about the budget process, and I hope we can continue to have that dialogue with our peers.